Ron has been um, attending Music Settlement here for about 18 years. Allie is nonverbal. Music therapy has been a lifeline. This was the beginning of a beautiful coming out for Alexa. Alexa was very quiet and very inward, and the music therapy is really, it, brought out her personality. She loves music. Um, she sings now, you know, which is really great. It's given um, confidence, bring out social skill, which you never had before. Um, Self-esteem is much better. Katie has a lot of needs, uh, special needs. Music is her big motivator. Since she's been coming to the music settlement, she has been a happier child. She loves to come. She enjoys working with her therapist. She likes the music. Very nice. I see her following directions more, speaking more, and just coming out more, um, more social, big time, since she started with music therapy. I'm teary because it has healed Ronald. It's been a long journey. Each day comes, I see improvement. And it's so important. I don't know what I'll do without. Oh, I liked your ending. From the very beginning, when music therapy was first started here in 1966, the idea was that it should be music for all. The settlement had the first community-based music therapy program in the world. We had no particular group of people we were there to serve. Music therapy was for those with special needs, old, young, uh, visually impaired, children with uh, developmental delay, adults with mental illness. And our challenge was how to let the entire Cleveland community know that the community music school was a place to come for this kind of service. You know, the settlement took a big risk with me. It was a brand new idea, and I was straight out of graduate school. I was, I had never been so frightened in my life. <laughs> I see a change in that now. We are much more evaluative in what we do. Um, not just thinking of progress in terms of touchy-feely, uh, it feels good so it must be working, but actually looking at it in a more scientific way. We have much more research now than we ever had before. And that's something the settlement did a great deal of and published research from the 60s on. So much has changed in the half century since our music therapy program began. There's a much better understanding of the nature of many disabilities and of how the brain processes music. There's much more of an appreciation for what people with special needs can do. And there's more of a willingness to make a place for everyone at the table as contributing members of the community. The payoff for me is every day or every week I witness changes. Changes in my clients or in the other people that we serve. I feel as though it, uh, you know, we're making a difference every day to help people come away from here feeling happier or feeling more accomplished, uh, help them be able to participate more completely in their lives and in the lives of their family and the community. Along with all the children and adults who come to us at the music settlement, we go out into the community. Our community outreach program brings music therapy to thousands of people throughout Northeast Ohio. We have over two dozen partnerships with agencies across the region. We bring gospel music to a senior center. We bring fellowship and self-awareness to the Salvation Army. We bring music and learning to school children in city and suburban schools. We bring hope and healing to patients in hospitals and hospice programs. The Salvation Army has been in partnership with um, the settlement for well before I was born. <laughs> Music therapy is important uh, because our, our urban children, especially our urban children, have, um, can come to school with many issues. We found that music therapy eases, calms, and even helps to educate children 
how to calm down? Our patients benefit in multiple ways. I think from an emotional standpoint, it brings them hope and joy and pleasure, um, as well as from a physical standpoint. Well, in terms of the value of music therapy, it, is, um, it has a profound effect on patients that are suffering. There is no question in my mind that music therapy has a positive effect on relieving stress, uh, lowering pulse rate, lowering blood pressure, making the patients feel better, and easing the amount of tension that they have. A music therapy is a way that people can do some introspection and change the way that they think. Our children uh, can uh, witness the, the joy that they bring because if you, you can't exude joy to someone else unless you have it. And that's what our music therapists exude to our children. Joy, joy, joy. It was the best time of my life. And who would have thought 50 years later, a lifetime later, it's still going strong. I've worked here for 28 years and I really believe in the settlement. I really love this place. There's always a new challenge. Uh, and there are always new ways to meet those challenges and new ways to impact the field. And I think we, got, we must keep that kind of uh, thought in our head as we look to the future. How to adapt to a changing environment is really important. I think that's what um, the settlement's doing now, is adapting to changes in the environment and going forward. You can count on me. Where else do you have a job where you get to play music every day and hear music every day? And I think we're very lucky. I'm very lucky to have found this job and this place and to be able to do what I do every day. Yeah.